Sentinel and Transluna. Don't wait. Leave your earthly worries, ulcers, and tumors behind. God, I feel sick. Don't like this at all. This porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news. I know. I'll be careful. Not exactly one of your strong suits. Listen, first sign of trouble, we Delta. She emptied the place. Shit. Excellent. You have come. Let's step to it then. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. Weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobud killed your father, no? I knew. From the start. You... knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate. Inconsistent. You knew? But didn't do a thing about it? Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Power. Family. Our family. I was to be its heart. To uphold life. Ensure continuity. Stability. Never to oppose it. Huh. Guess your Nobu's instructions were a little different? 
Yorinobu raised his hand against our father. But he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. We were gonna talk biz? Specifics? Let us do so. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. on the trigger. Don't say a word. Of course I didn't bring Soul Killer. Afraid we don't know each other that well. You prefer to keep your guard up. Understandable, but unnecessary. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Minen, Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. And you'll help me in exchange for... My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. Just say it. Be easier that way. I want him punished. Still vague. You want him dead. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu... Hanako-sama, soro-soro gojitaku ni omodori itadaite. Sugu ni sumu wa. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify? Listen, mind if I'm straight with you? Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Don't like this at all. Sounds like you want to use me. No. I simply offer you an opportunity. Not the first to try. But what if I am the last? You cannot take that chance. Let's fly the fuck out of here. V, do you feel all right? Huh? You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Ah, Make ah, your decision. Think it over. You could use some air. Right now. <coughs> I warned you. What, what are you doing? Shit, it could be hours from it now, V. You can't stand on your own two feet. Well, I'm good to go. Body listens to me. See what I'm getting at? Yeah, I get it. And don't like it one bit. I'm still Come going on, strong. Come on, face the facts. Pop some pseudo endotrizine. Scooch and let me get behind the wheel. I'll get us to fucking Mikoshi. Uh-huh. How exactly? Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Don't stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. Maybe she'd have stuck her neck out for you a half a century ago. But now... I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower, just like we did back in the day. 
then find the way inside Makoshi. It's our only chance. Rogue? I don't know. You honestly think it could work? With her experience, her resources, her connections. Won't find anyone better in NC. Johnny. It's gotta work. We breach the tower. Alt cracks open Makoshi. Then I fuck up that. Great, you checking out again? Just yet. Vic. You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the table and demanded you be treated immediately. Tell him it was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh, wasn't completely myself. Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. So, <clears throat> how bad we talking? That bad, huh? All right. That should be a little better. Try sitting up carefully. Okay, but don't ex <sighs> slowly. <sighs> Another victory. For the history books. Hmm. If you got something to... How much long... You'd... Look at it. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. This is your last chance to take... No. No. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah. What about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo-endotrize in there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. <sighs> or find another way. End things on your own terms. Got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you, and you alone. You heard him. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Endotrizine. Rogue. Sokka Tower. Only way this is gonna work. Give it a fucking rest, Johnny. It's my decision. And I gotta think about it. Need to stretch your noodle? Fine. Fine. Just not, Just not in this basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Uh, out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. Think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here. Hey, V, I heard... Well... Your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy. 
for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure, lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What, what's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. Top floor. He had the same glum face. Who, oh, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder. Your gang Chumba's on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm-hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but... He found the courage to bet on himself. After. Ah, that's more I brought like him here. air. See that? I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. my thoughts you're on unachievable these days so what what is jack oh you know gonna be a legend and i'm gonna leave you alone now take your time fucking scared me know that thought you were on your way out No, still here. For now. You know, should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way, just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. Judy. Yeah, even I've grown to like her. She ought to know that. Hey, Judy. Oh, hey, V. What's cracking? Time we, uh, went swimming. <laughs> a lot of fun, wasn't it? What you said then, about what you sensed in me. Death. Wish it'd been anything else. Something nice. Hey, not like it was your fault. Here's hoping it comes out better next time. Listen, whatever it is you're gonna try, just be careful, okay? I'm here waiting. Thanks. Do my best. <sighs> okay. What's good you called? Wish I'd have had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think. 
It all started in a fucking landfill. <laughs> then you tried to kill me. See exactly what I mean. Trying to save your sorry hide now. You can let me do that. Or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats. But then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your conscience. Gonna try to ask Pan Am for help. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. Gonna try this with Pan Am. Got a feeling you're gonna regret this decision. And the moment that dawns, I won't be there to help. Could be my last ride, this. If it don't work out. Just wanna be there for it. Aware. See you inside, Makoshi. Johnny? Hey, just me now. P? Hey, Pan Am. Do you know what time it is? I know, but need your help. And you owe me a favor. What's so damn urgent I couldn't wait until morning? Need a way into our Arasaka Tower. Now. Sorry, what? I'm serious. Whole thing with Johnny, I don't do something soon, I'm done. Gone. Slow down. First, why Arasaka Tower? The tech. Underneath that tower, they got an access point to... Well, odd as it sounds, a prison of souls. A prison of souls? <laughs> Knew this might not fly over the hollow. Wakoshi. That's its name. Only place Johnny and I can disentangle for good. It's my last chance. So, again, just to be clear, you've called me at High Moon to ask me to help you break into Arasaka Tower, or you'll die. About the gist of it, yeah. Okay. W okay Where are you? Vic's clinic. The Ripper? Right, I know where it is. Can you hold off on dying for a bit? Give it a shot, sure. Good. Don't go anywhere. I'm coming to get you. Is that you, V? Or... Yeah, it's me. So, what now? Waiting for my driver. Come inside. We'll wait together. Since you have to wait, mind if I give you a reading? Sure, why not? Some believe uncertain. We should. I divide. Your. F okay, I'm ready. We'll start with you, V. The fool. <laughs> what a surprise. Let's dig deeper to find its meaning here. The Fool symbolizes the start of a journey, the announcement of something new. It's the inner child, curious of the world, but also naive and reckless. <laughs> Sounds a lot like the V I first met. The Magician. A 
person of great talent and charisma. A leader. Sounds like Johnny. The card is reversed. That can mean a tendency toward addiction, mental instability. Oh, okay, definitely Johnny. He has one great disturbance. The final cards are about your futures. The lovers. <sighs> Something that doesn't give me the chills. Finally. Balance, friendship, love. Though it can also mean difficult choices ahead. Ain't that the truth. Okay, and Johnny's? The moon. Well, that doesn't sound too bad, right? I don't know, V. The moon is mystery. Hmm. I think that's for you. Yep. No mistake in that ride ever. Hey. Man, it's good to see your face. Jesus, you really do look terrible. And I feel worse. Then we had best not waste any time. We have a long road ahead of us. Come on. Everybody's waiting at camp. Look out for yourself, V. <laughs> Welcome back to the living. You feeling okay? Um, I guess. Mighty good to hear. You had us worried back there. You passed out and we couldn't shake you awake. It sure does seem like your uh, condition might be getting worse. Pan Am asked me to keep an eagle eye on you. Where'd she go? She's off debating Saul. You need help, that's clear. They sat right down to figure out how we might do that. Come on, I'll take you to see him. So, V, I heard talk that there's a war coming. Afraid I don't got a choice, Look, Mitch. Cat dragged in. Looks like we don't have one neither. The whole clan knows we set out tomorrow. They know why. What our aim is. Look around, V. War tested <laughs> veterans are a fistful at most. The rest mostly raid rinky dink convoys and salvage scrap. So for now, they only know as much as they the need to know. The plan is solid, Saul. The aim is to help you out. Your waters. Not now. We're sending this clan to its grave. Fuck, you think I don't know that? And yet you seem to think you can change something by chewing me out like you usually do. V, finally. How's your health? I <clears throat> did some sleep, is all. I heard you were already cooking up a plan. We still have details to iron out. But we know the who, where, and how. Have a look for yourself. A few strategies we sussed out. But only one grants us a decent shot at penetrating Arasaka Tower. We'll dig a tunnel. So you want a tunnel into Arasaka Tower? I know how it sounds. But we'd be plumb fools not to take advantage. I see Night Corps building a new maglev line in the area. Granted, it's guarded by Militech, but they're nothing we can't handle. Once we're in that tunnel, it's just half a mile to the substratum levels of Arasaka Tower. They're using one of Night Corp's cirques. It would only need a few minutes to dig that distance. Not bad, wouldn't you say? Once we're in, we'll have to improvise. Guards, security measures, the fastest way into Mikoshi. We'll take things as they come and hope for the best. V, any thoughts? The plan, entire op. It's about heading into enemy territory. You'll make enemies of Arasaka and others. So it appears. I'm exposing you. All of you. To danger. Want out? Want to cut your losses? I'd understand. No hard feelings. You came to us for help. We decided we'd provide it. Our minds are made up. No more discussion needed. It's settled. We had best get to work. I'll talk to our brothers and sisters. Get a drone buzzing over that site. And I'll check with Mitch. I think I know how to even the odds against Militech. Come find us later. I'll leave you in Saul's hands now. Just no making decisions without me. Is there anything else you need? I need a decent net connection. Someone I know can help us get into Mikoshi. Who might that be? Alt. She... It's... 
an AI from out past the black. Are you fully present up there? Why in hell would an AI help us break into Mikoshi? Because I'll ask it to. Nicely. Fuck me, V. You know what? Fine. We're up to our balls and dung anyway. Might as well go deeper. Find Dakota. She'll get you geared up. No questions asked. Thanks, Saul. Thank me once we get out of Mikoshi alive and in one piece. That America's long gone and forgotten. Prep coming along all right? <laughs> you call this prep? I'd call it a damn improvisation. But that's just Can me. Can it, Bobby? Lo and behold. Isn't this... In theory, we fitted an afterburner and a multi-RPG launcher up top. We also scooped out about 60% of its total mass. Beautiful, isn't she? You'll take the wheel with Pan Am riding shotgun. Let's get back to the matter at hand, shall we? <laughs> See? Hello? I drove it! A monster, not a machine. Hey, Dakota. 
I'm V. We've never met. Chamai, what is it? Need us. Eyes filled. Carol, here to help Dakota? Evidently. You good to go? Can't say. Even if you look like you're about to flatline? All right, time to move. Follow the vector, sister. Hello, Alt. You come alone. Johnny is currently indisposed. Currently. He is buried deeper. You treat him like an unwanted past. I had no choice. It was the only way I could come here. Meet with you. Repression. You are good at this and improving. Let me get... And since he's not here this... I do not aim to back out. <sighs> to observe the two of you. It... You truly believe time to be your... You exist or you do not exist. Matter of perspective. Think what you will, but it seems... You believe you... It is death. You... This you will come to understand in Mikoshi. Or rather you. You should already have a notion. You... What should I... A boundary to cross. In all likelihood, the sole moment. A burden. I'll make... Well... Constructs imprisoned there. They will be integrated with me. Wasting time talk. There. I sent a program to your Netrunner shard. It opens a secure connection. Should I look for a specific access point? Can already tell you ICE all the way to Tokyo will be backing every single one. Some need but a barely cracked door to enter. You... Until... We got her back. Carol, the shard! Relax, child. You barely jacked in when your temperature went skyward to almost 105. The tech started acting as if infected. No. Stranger. Spookier. What happened here? You melted half my tech! That's what happened! Neural activity spiked sharply. Your frontal lobe was seconds away from flowing out your ears, babe. I could just as well have popped a bullet in your head. Are you sure you're all right? PG. Good. Real good. The shard. Wrote some soft I need to one of the shards. Please. We're surrounded by ice. Even if something punched through, my controllers would have... Holy... Get it away from me. Thanks, Dakota. Don't thank me. Case exact. It's going well. Just finishing cyber. You'll take the wheel with Pan Am riding shotgun. Afterburner, standard nitro or military grade? Standard couldn't move this baby an inch. So hardware's military. But how the hell did you cram all that into a Panzer? Oh, uh, small beans compared to the tricks we pulled with Scorpion during the war. When we unleash this beast tomorrow, you'll see. Talk later then, I guess. So, you wanted a word? Hop up here. We going somewhere? All right, V. It's a simple matter. We, all of us standing here. Oh, cool, thanks. I'll do the same. It's a great debt. Speak for yourself, Saw. But in spite of that, you're still an outsider. A mercenary from Night City. 
what might as well be another world. Hey, ask Pan Am. She knows. So it's about time we fix that. A downright injustice it is. It needs fixing. You're gonna be an Aldecaldo. Which means this family will go to hell and back for you. Ready, kid? Speech! Do your worst. Speech! You're one of us now, B. You're an Aldecaldo, damn it. Great to Thanks have for you everything, with us, B. V, and don't worry. We'll get you into that Makoshi. Isn't that the welcome way Welcome to the family. A warm welcome for our newest Aldecaldo! She flabbergasted! Welcome to the clan! The most dysfunctional ever! Thanks Come on, for everything, V. v. Say your piece! Aldecaldos always pay their debts! Jacket's incredible. See? She likes it. Listen, soon as we're back from Makoshi, <laughs> we'll celebrate. And I know just the place. My treat, of course. We'll hold you to that. Don't worry. It's but a formality. You've been a de facto member of this family for a while now. You saved my rumpus, and as Bobby tells it, Mitch is too. I won't even mention Pan Am. Go to hell. Saul's right, though. I mean, let's face it, V. My life was in a million pieces. You broke it into a million more. But sometimes it's only then that you can piece it together again. All right, fam, listen up. Today we celebrate, but tomorrow is shaping up to be a hell of a day. Do whatever needs doing. Then get some rest. A raid is a raid. Calls for a drink, this is still I say. your night. We'll some basketball and you. found glory. Could have given me a heads up about this. And ruined all the fun? Are you kidding? Are you all right? Yeah. It's nothing. Don't worry about it. And how's the jacket? Not too tight? As snug as a glove. Feels like I've been wearing it a while. Don't you think you have? You earned this jacket. And the Aldecaldo's devotion. Thanks, Pan Am. If you want to talk, I'll be up there. Listen to this. Barbarians do not travel. And they need some ammunition. Three or four packs worth. Do you got any left? I might What's have. This? You have to look Yard around. Sale of some sort? So maybe I'll take two more 45s. Take what you want. And as Dakota the occasion be would be today. the end times. Worthy gesture. Dramatic, even. Actually, pragmatic. I'm giving away my stock to you so you survive tomorrow's mad hell and come back to me. All them countries, tongues, cultures on top of each other. We had the melting pot. We just threw everyone in. Well, history is a blind, malevolent bitch, isn't it? I mean, look at this country now. What country? Exactly. Or how about this? In spite of all the dangers, that which is in motion will always outlast what is at rest. For change is more noble than idleness. Well, that's why we're out here, and we're not there. I had it just a second That's ago, I swear. Yeah. You Just caught I'll, I'll come chatter. back when I want to. Militech broadcast yeah. on modular frequency. Uh -huh. so, Forget it. So what? And if I do latch on to their signal and we find out who's on the site, 
What then, huh? Hey, if you manage to get past their jammers and they're running down the streets of Wolverine, you know, think we'll pull through tomorrow. I know these people. Some better than myself. The focus of mind, sense of purpose, calm before the storm. They'll give it their all. <laughs> Bet they will. Good night, Saul. Wait. Hmm? I feel I need to make one thing clear. You've done a lot for this clan, and for me, more than anyone ever has. But the family comes first. Saul. Let me finish. I also know there's just one thing that could break it up at this point. If Pan Am and me... If we went our separate ways, the Aldecaldos would not survive that split were it to occur again. Do you understand what I'm trying to tell you? You're helping, because you got no choice. Want the clan to think. It isn't that. V, I'll send these people to their deaths tomorrow. So I have to know I'm not doing it just for you, me, or Pan Am. But for the good of the clan. I get it. You'll understand eventually. That jacket wasn't for nothing. How about us, Saul? We good? It's an important day tomorrow. Get some rest. in those conditions. I'll see to the sensors. You keep checking the thrust. Maybe something. Do you know where I saw the stars? <laughs> Hardly anyone ever does. You'll be steering this butte tomorrow. Would you like to give her a whirl? Yeah. I'm game. Hop in. <clears throat> All right, fire her up. I've got green across the board. Good sign. Where are we headed? Bobby said there's a scrapyard east of camp. Perfect spot for a little target practice.
Now let's check Bobby's little find. Punch it, V. Does it seem like she's tending to the left? Uh, fixable, you think? Just keep shooting at those rust buckets. I'll recalibrate the targeting on the go. Feels better, doesn't it? Seems so. Last another, just to be sure. Yep, beautiful. All right, that's probably good. Let's head back. I'll have to check before tomorrow if her guts are tight and firm. Something just don't sound right to my ear. Are we heading back? I'll take her now. I get picky about parking. We have a saying, catch you on the trail. Salam Alaikum. Um, what a freak. Mm. Hey, guess what? I don't talk to strangers. You know, the, uh, yeah, uh, uh, unless... You... Don't... <sighs> Why the hell not? Back during the war, before we were first deployed, we were trained to keep stress in check. Do you want to know how? How? They gave us chem cocktails. Supplements, boosters, God knows what else. They shot them into our veins. Our biomons went wild, but only for a second before stabilizing, and boy, did we stabilize. After a dozen sessions, something clicks in your brain. Neural pathways get rewired. The part of you that generates fear is zapped into oblivion. That's seriously fucked. What'd you think? One will head into... What? I'm not... What's that? They seem to think that there's gossip spreading like wildfire already. 
Don't want to come off as an ungrateful bitch, but really hope this... It won't. Saul and Pan Am did one thing right, at least. They welcomed you into the clan. Not a one will abandon you in your hour of need. It's like this, see? Pan Am's hell-bent on helping you. But Saul sees this whole thing as an opportunity. Possible loot from Makoshi? Mm-hmm. If we pull this off, get our hands on some sweet Arasaka tech that'll set us up down south. Do you follow? Italy's full. Saul's a smooth operator. All right, we've gossiped enough for one day. What was... Right. Don't just stand there, have a Darn. seat. So nice. Hey guys, I gotta go. Uh, I'll, uh, sorry. Uh, check you later. Thanks for following.